That's a banana, not a hammer. <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? D Live here, and I am here with some more wardrobe. We are out on the construction site with this crazy blind man. We gotta talk to this guy. We got the up dog, which is pretty cool. Back in my day, the screws were tightened clockwise. Wait, calm the fuck down. Even his blindness never gets him down. I mean, he's he's kind of he's kind of like going crazy on these construction beds. Doesn't even cave and see them. Sorry, sir. Can I bother you for a second? Whoa. Don't you see? I'm really busy right now, boy. Are you blind? Tell me this is a joke. You're talking. That would be... That would be death. What are you doing exactly? What are you doing exactly? I'm working. Unlike all those incompetent slackers. But you no. are blind. Not at all. I can see perfectly. I don't need anyone's help. Hmm. Which number am I making with my fingers? Four. <laughs> okay, at least now we know we're not dealing with one more fake cripple. Whoa. Jeez. You really have a strange taste when really it comes to clothing. really have a strange taste when it comes to clothing. Brown and black are absolutely classic, boy. Timeless. <laughs> but actually, you... You young people today don't understand a thing. Go back to your hip flops <laughs> and pursue a living in bad taste. Jesus. You have pink pants, which are pretty... Pretty awesome. I have to give it to you. I think he has a. I don't think that's a. Is that a. I can't think of it. It's blanking. I'm, I'm becoming more stupid with this game. <laughs> These are pipes of various sizes. I suppose they're for the sewers or something like that. <gasps> oh, maybe we need those. Yeah, we need the metal pipes. There's a. I still don't know what I have to do other than help the crocodile. And like get by those guys, the mover guys. Oh wait, can we combine anything? Like the pills and this. I have to find something to dissolve them in. <gasps> oh, so we need we d we need some water. Okay. All right, so let's get out of here. Is there water? I gotta be on the lookout for water. Trickle. Is that for the water? I don't remember there being a actual. Yes. Sweet. Cheers. Cheers. All right, so do we? Now put the pills in the water. Yes, concoction. Didn't he need to like become stronger or something? Do we give him the concoction? Because there's nothing really here that would make any sense. If I give him a fork, what is that gonna do? Let's see if we can give him I this. I found the solution to your problems. Mainly because if I waited for him to solve it, I would have died another time first. What am I supposed to do? You just have to open your mouth and say, ah. Uh... Okay. Oh, he has a tongue. I didn't know what. He's evolving. He's evolving. <laughs> dust ball became dust champ or dust muscle. <laughs> I feel. Whoa. I feel a great power in my hands. What do we have created? We created something. Minute. I have hands. Oh yeah, you do. <laughs> You have hands. Sounds more threatening already, right? <laughs> All right, so can we... What was the point of that? Nothing happened. Do we talk to him now? How do you feel? How do you feel? Better than ever. I feel like I can break the whole world. Jeez. <laughs> he sounds like Santa Claus. Just try to take it over, okay? And one of the, like, animated things. Unfortunately, it seems we haven't made any progress regarding intelligence. Jeez, give him a chance. What about the Swiffer? What about the Swiffer? I don't know who this Swiffer is, but <laughs> I will punch him to death. <laughs> Jeez. Ah. This should be interesting. In my opinion, you're not so strong after all. Are you looking what to get punched? What are you talking about? Don't you see I'm a beast? <laughs> it doesn't seem that way to me. Oh. Test me then. Oh, okay. what do we need? In the room next door, there's a bed. I bet you won't be able to unscrew one of the knobs. It'll be child's play. Wait, unscrew one of the knobs? How about like just beat up Is the movers? The knob. It's not a crystal ball, that's for sure. <gasps> oh yeah, we can uh, we can interact with this. Yes, that's the one. <laughs> it's up to me. He and didn't get the joke. Now, knob. Oh. Wow, he's a very strong guy. All right, so. 
What do we do with a knob? This is like maze. Like some of the puzzles, I have no idea what I'm doing. Knob is the new Excalibur. Knob is the new Excalibur? Okay. Can you be more specific? I'm trying to figure out what works. don't have the strength to counter still more stupidity with a witty reply. Okay, I gotta figure this out, man. Better not. Can I... A little too heavy, don't you I think? I can't take it. Is there something in my inventory that I can use? What? What does that make any sense? What does that do? What does that do for me? Tell me what that does for me. Okay, what did they give me? Give me a screw. <gasps> Wait a second. Does this go to the drill? Yes. Can we drill the, the crocodile now? Because the drill is we're going to drill something out of his. He's got something stuck. We're like a dentist, a makeshift dentist. Don't tell this guy. Backup is coming. Yes. Open your jaws. Oh. And no funny business. Oh, God. <laughs> Don't die. Don't die. Did we get it out? He's got really. He's got gingivitis going on, man. That's gross. It's so liberating. Kind oh. of like when I escaped from prison. <laughs> I don't know if you're being serious or you're just spectacularly trolling. We'll never find out. Oh. I just helped you, man. I just helped you. Okay? So what do we got? Gears, can they go in the clock? Okay, we fixed the clock. So that means we go outside. And we go up the ladder. And we wake up the homeless man. That's out there, that big old hobo. So we should be able to do the clock. Things are finally coming together. I feel like I'm I'm on to something. I don't know what the dentures does. Maybe we can floss the dentures? We can try that. Alright. Hey that big guy though. He's got some jelly on his shirt. Alright. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Oh, he's angry. You lost one of your shoes. <laughs> Sorry. So can we go there now? I'm a little scared from that guy. He's crazy. He's a, a little bit crazy. Okay, we're going here. Where does this take us? Oh, our little friends out here, nut. All right, so there's this down here, a hole. This has home. I have a new appreciation of the quality of life inside the wardrobe. Ah, can you talk but to it? I need you to be done with these holes. You're ruining our lawn. <laughs> so I can't. Can Better I... not touch it. I think it's part of the scenery. Okay. All right. So we have this. We can open no this. No way. It's closed. Okay. Well, I'm sorry. Can't open it. All right. Let's go talk to Nut. You should be able to recognize Nut by now. I did. It took you long enough. Hmm. And where did you pop up from? This van is a wreck. I got out through a hole hidden in the floor. Is there a way to get in from under there? Negative, dude. My head may be huge, but nowhere near like yours. How about taking a ride with me? All aboard. Whoa, I picked up Nut. <laughs> that sounded weird, but I picked him up. I don't know where I'm taking him. Can I like throw him in there? All right, there's something going on here that I can do. Ah, that's the way we move. <laughs> Can we open this? I wasn't holding my breath on it being open. Fuck. All right, was there anything we missed? There's something going on over there. Is there anything else we missed here? No, okay. What is going on? Oh, it's a thief. The supposedly well-guarded local prison never fails to make its citizens feel safe. There's a guy stealing shit up there. Can I talk, yell at him? I don't think he needs further motivation. He's stealing. That guy. So I can't do anything with him, right? When I feel the need to rob a bank, I will know where to turn. <laughs> All right, so what do we have? A pink flamingo. <gasps> Claptrap! And a GameCube. And Aladdin. Jesus. So many. Why would you throw a Oh, he's a trash can. <laughs> I guess that's. And there's Batman, too. God damn, all these references. So. Come on, let's get him. I give. Don't laze around. <gasps> <laughs> <gasps> All right, so now we get the megaphone. Is that what we need? I don't know if this actually will work, but I took the megaphone. All right, so can I combine it? I feel bad for Nut, but I just like threw him. Can I put this together? There you go. So now we're gonna get rid of the robber, which I don't know what that really does. So now 
We should be able to megaphone this guy. Whoa! Why did he do that? The crowbar! Now we can break into the truck. Yes, thank you. Take take me with you, crowbar. Why couldn't I just walk over and play it right there? All right. God, get out of here. Grab that shit. All right, so now we're gonna crowbar this shit out of the back of this. Or do we need to break into the van? We oh, did it. finally did it then. When you use nice manners, you get everything you want, nut. Oh. So can I just go in? I thought I could break open too. Can I like, oh, the crowbar's gone. So we only have one use of it. Okay, so can I just go in? Am I good to go? For a moment, I assumed the worst. We need oh. to celebrate. Take this. Take what? How the hell often do I have to tell you I'm allergic? <laughs> it's a damned nut. Do you even have eyes in those sockets? Several hours later. Oh man. Something stinks here. It wasn't me. I mean, where the hell did those two go? I'll get out. I have to check. Whoa. All right, so it's not ready yet. So we. Oh, I thought we were good to go, man. I thought we were good to go. I thought we were good. So we need to do something with those two. Oh, we can go in the front now? I see we're dealing with a Nobel laureate here. Okay. I never knew I could go that way, but you know, it's cool. All right, so we have to go check on them. So let's go see what they're doing. Oh, they're still Isn't having- Isn't it a bit late? Oh. Have you checked the time? Yeah, from that clock, boss. You can relax. Oh. I like lunch breaks. <laughs> Too bad that pendulum has been stuck for years. <gasps> so we have to do something with the pendulum. We have the, we have something with time. Okay. Megaphone them? Just be like, get to work. Uh. I never tried to do that before. Can I do something with this to make the pendulum work? What can I do with a fork and a string? You do it. There's something un. I don't know why I saw the megaphone. Can you be more specific? A bit of lateral thinking surely doesn't hurt. This has got to go to with this. This could start the final. Better not. All right. So what can we do with this? The sword? I don't have the strength to counter still more stupidity with a witty oh, reply. Oh, fuck you. What is this? Hide here? Oh! Okay. Hide here? I can't. They would see me. All right. So we need something. Do we need to pull it? First, I have to wait until they aren't looking this way. Oh, shit. So I have to wait for them not to be looking. And I harpoon my way over. That's literally what that was. So what am I doing with that box? I guess I'm going to become a box? First, I have to make sure they're not looking. Okay. So I wait for them to not be looking. I don't know what the harpoon did. Ah, I went in a box and moved. How the hell did they not see me? All right, can I, what do I do now? Go over here. <gasps> Aha, so we're gonna fix, we're gonna move the hands. So they actually go and do something. Ah, yay. Good job! It was freaking gum. Are you kidding me? There he goes. Goodbye. So now we have to go and get... Are we in there now? Those or... two are still not coming. What are they doing now? Oh! Uh, going back to take a look. God fucking damn it. What are they doing now? Broken window. He took a really nice flight. No doubt about it. <laughs> he did. I could justify such an action only... Okay, well, I know you're gonna be angry, you're not gonna like what I'm saying, but, you know, what? whatever. All right, can we go this way now? Do I need to rem Okay, Jesus, I thought maybe I could take a shortcut. I have no idea where these weebs are, but they're fucking annoying the shit out of me. All right, are they still out here? 
We're not here anymore. Not while that massive plum blocks the door. Okay, so the plum is a problem. Can we harpoon it? This could start the final battle between the good and the cavities. All right, so we still have gum, so we're supposed to take... We can't go through that way. There's some cool stuff over here. I like how he keeps chewing that gum. Is he up? Are they upstairs or are they in the kitchen? They still have a lot of stuff to move. Are you kidding me? Oh. That's it. Now we'll do it the hard way. Are we gonna megaphone them? We're gonna do it the hard way. There's Twister. I can't. We'll do it the hard way? What does that mean? There's literally nothing I can do here. We'll do it the hard way. Am I gonna drive myself? I don't understand what the hard way means. I have a little walkthrough thing I'm looking at. And oh my God, this game. It's hilarious, but I think it's way too hard without hints. Or like some kind of thing, like when you get stuck, it's like, oh, do something here. All right, so. Sorry, but I need you to return my chewing gum. <laughs> All right, so that's basically what we had to do. And now we take it to the cement mixer. Yeah, the cement mixer. And it's kind of like back and forth, back and forth. I love the game. I think it's really cool. But if it could be like just like a little hint thing when you get real stuck, you won't get so frustrated. All right, so we take the gum, a giant wad of chewing gum, and we... Go into the cement mixer. All right, so we got a fast-setting chewing gum. I don't I know. I know what to do. A bit of lateral thinking surely doesn't hurt. Okay, so now I don't the know use what of to the do. Mouse is a bit of lateral thinking. I thought maybe it had something with the aluminum. You do it. I don't think I'll make. I'm running out of. Okay. So what do I do with this? I don't know. I wouldn't have been able to do this without help. It's just like one of those things. Would have not been able to do this without help. So you put the the gum in here. And apparently that takes it out. Oh, I broke it. Although today we crossed rifles on the battlefield, you've been a valiant soldier. You earned my respect. Wow. All right, so then you put this thing in. Better set up the timer to guarantee an escape route. Am I gonna start a fire? Am I gonna burn this house down? <gasps> oh, look at that. Oh shit. The sprinkler's on. Oh, the water is tickling me. I like it. <laughs> Come on, let's get back to the van and get out of here. So I woke them up. That kind of makes sense. I don't like these kind of days. You're telling me. If I find out who pried my van open, ugh, oh. remember your heart condition, boss. <laughs> You're right. Let's just think about delivering everything and forget today, okay? All right, are we good? Do we finally are make you it? Ready for the new house? I haven't even thought about it, actually. I just want to talk to Ronald as soon as possible. Why all this rush? Sorry, but I wasn't paying any attention earlier. I was too busy with my nuts. <laughs> Basically, according to otherworldly laws, the perpetrators of a blood sin will be condemned to eternal damnation when they die. But Ronald's was an accident. That doesn't change anything. It's irrelevant. The only way to prevent this from happening is to confess his crime to someone else. Oh. Within five years. And how much time does he have left exactly? Three days. And you're just thinking about it now? I didn't oh. want to overwhelm him. I wanted to give him his space. I really have no words. Oh shit. So it's been that long. Damn. Okay, so it's been five years since this all happened. I wasn't sure if it was a couple weeks. Now I understand. Okay. So he will be subject to eternal damnation because he killed me. Pretty much. Whoa. What the fuck? <gasps> they threw it out! 
They threw out Ugh, my wardrobe. Damn spoiled brats. Hey, boy, is everything okay? Tell me, that fall cut out your tongue? N no sir. Isn't it too early to wear your costume? It's only afternoon. Um, what? You probably hit your head too hard on the ground. It's Halloween today. Oh. Otherwise, why would you wear that stupid skeleton costume? Oh, uh, yes. Uh, yes, of course. Uh, for Halloween, obviously. Bah. Try not to make too much trouble while you're still around. Capiche? More Sunday notes. <laughs> Brats. Jesus. That was a big fall. So they threw me out in the junkyard? There's a monkey Where the over hell there. Am I? You're in a junkyard, dude. You've been tossed Did out. Did throw my wardrobe in a dump? Yes. Okay, calm down. I know the address of Ronald's new house. The problem is getting the wardrobe over there. Aha. So we're gonna have to get going with this. Oh my god. The puzzles in this game are ridiculous. Uh, I would not have been able to make that without help. That's the only bad thing about this game. I really love it. It's, a, it's a great, got a great art style. It's very funny. It's just so hard to figure things out. Like some stuff like the megaphone, I knew I kind of needed it. So I'm just going to have to fiddle with things and mix and match. And on every little thing, throw every item I have at it and see what happens. It's kind of what it's going to do. It's not even like thinking anymore. It's just like throw all this shit at this thing and see if it works. Really like the game, but it's... At least that first part was really confusing. Hopefully, maybe it gets easier. But I hope you guys are enjoying this game. It's got a lot of cool little Easter eggs, some stuff. There's Godzilla and the monkey. They fought each other, and there's the Empire State Building above it. So that's pretty cool. There's a little Godzilla and the King Kong reference, and little planes in Empire State Building from King Kong. So there's a lot of references. There's stuff I don't even see. But it's it's like it's it's a really cool game. I really enjoy the comedy and the artwork and stuff. It's just that the puzzles are a little too hard in my opinion. And it like you look back at it with hindsight and you're like, oh, that was easy. But when you're like playing it, you're trying to figure out what goes with what. I wouldn't have thought of putting the gum in the microwave and then messing up that machine so it couldn't figure out that there was gonna be a fire to wake those guys up with a sprinkler. I didn't even think of that. That I wouldn't have even thought of, so that's pretty tough. I guess anything you can talk with, you can fuck with, but the robot we never talked with. So, and Teddy we talked, or the robot we talked with, but we never did anything with the robot. We talked with Teddy, he just died. Um, so everybody else we talked to, so if we talk to somebody or it's some person, nine times out of ten, it's probably going to be something we have to do with. Okay, so I'm rambling here, but I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of The Wardrobe. Really cool game, just a little tough with the puzzles, but I hope to see you guys in part three, and I will catch you later. Bye!